You mentioned technological innovation. Talk to us practically how that is manifested at a company like yours and quantify for us, if you will, the potential savings and cost and productivity for your company from technological innovation. So within our company, we run two very big businesses. One is an institutional business and the second is a consumer business. So starting on the consumer part of our business, we have, uh, starting about a year, year and a half ago, really pushed hard in terms of what we call our mobile first strategy in believing that uh, mobile and tablet based banking is really the future. And in fact, if you, uh, if you look today, banking and mobile banking in terms of apps is the third most visited site. Really? Yeah, social media, social networks, number one, weather, number two, and banking, number three. Second is over the past year, we've seen mobile adoption rates, i.e. people kind of coming on and using those apps, up 50% wow. amongst the highest uh, engagement rates going forward. And then as we look at the future uh, and we look at the millennials, 91% of millennials uh, believe that their mobile app is better than going into a branch, a branch <laughs> bank. And so uh, it's coming, but in there we've also got to recognize that you know, we have a continuum of bank clients you know, ranging from senior citizens, the elderly, right. all the way through the millennials, and we need to serve all of them. So there's a very much a transition in progress. Does every young banker entering city need to understand technology in a, in a, at, a, at a fundamental level? Well, you know, I, I wouldn't say that they all have to be coders, okay. but I would say we would love them to be um, technologically literate, which certainly most are as they come, but right alongside that, we're more than willing to invest in, in them. And again, we're just looking for the, the right skill sets. You know, we're looking for people with intellect. We're looking for people with integrity. And importantly, we're looking for people with intellectual curiosity. And when you think about financial services today, your willingness to explore, your willingness to try something different. And again, different from how we spoke about things in the past, your willingness to accept, but not be defined by failure. Because as we iterate and move quickly, we will, will fail. we will fail, but, we're gonna, but provided we learn from those things and we get better from them and we get faster, that's the path we wanna be on.